call it stair stepping of schedules. Big way you're going to save money in labor is to not bring all your people in at one time. Sometimes you'll see a schedule and they'll have seven employees. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Come in at one time, let's say 11 o'clock. That line signifies that the employee is working from 11 to 12. And they'll bring seven employees in at 11. But yet, my sales projection doesn't necessarily show that I need seven employees at 11. So this strategy is called stair-stepping schedules. I can literally take my, my schedule, and I can literally have one person coming in at 11, one come in at 11.10, one come in at 11.20, one come in at 11.30, one come in at 11.45, and whatever the case may be. And the dollars that are saved by those 10 and 15 minutes are huge because here's what happens. You bring in seven employees at once, and they stand around and mingle. And, What'd you do last night? Oh, I like your shoes. Eh, whatever they talk about. And they mingle and they mingle and they mingle and they blow 15 minutes. Versus if I bring them all in one at a time, even five minutes apart, you add that up based on their average hourly rate and you multiply it by 365 days a year and the savings are unbelievable. You wouldn't imagine how much it is. Try it. Literally. The same happens with when they're going out of their shift. A lot of times you'll see a restaurant and 2 o'clock will come or 1.30 will come and they'll cut everybody off. They all get cut off at the exact same time. But yet my projection doesn't say that. My projection says, you know what, I could stair-step them out too. I could have one person leave five minutes earlier. I could have one person leave ten minutes earlier than that. And again, what you will see is a stair step that basically looks like this. Going in, coming out, however it is. It can be five or ten minute increments, doesn't matter. But you'll see the stair steps in and the stair steps out. The number of employees going into a peak period, the number of employees coming out of a peak period, lunch and dinner, and you're talking tens of thousands of dollars a year in savings. Really, in most restaurants, the volume of money that you would save from stair-stepping would pay for the manager's annual salary.